So uh, one of the things that were observed by my colleagues, uh, Dr. Betsy Rapaski at Roswell Park, was the uh, association of stress. This was usually um, related to um, temperature stress in animals that is mediated by adrenergic receptors. And under that stressful situation, uh, the role of immune checkpoint inhibitors is limited. Uh, if you remove that stress by warming the animals, uh, immune checkpoint inhibitors become uh, a much more potent uh, approach to therapy. Since that's mediated through adrenergic uh, receptors, uh, particularly adrenergic receptor type 2 uh, and 3, uh, a panadrenergic receptor blocker like propanolol may be used uh, to try to enhance the outcomes. And uh, this has been observed in retrospective studies uh, in many different cancers where uh, a pan beta blocker has been associated with better outcomes. And the phase one study really identified that it is uh, safe to give propanolol uh, with an immune checkpoint inhibitors, uh, that we saw at least in the phase one group of patients, a significant uh, percentage of patients responding with deep responses. And so that study is now an ongoing multi-center study, uh, phase two, to establish whether this uh, new therapeutic combination uh, will be able to go forward into a phase three study.